Hello citizens of the world. In this video, we are going to learn how to create free eye-catchy animated videos that you can use for your presentations, for your website. If you're a freelancer, you can create your animated video for your Fiverr profile, upvocalguru.com profile, or if you've got a good YouTube channel, you can create nice intros and outros using this technique. Canva.com uh, is a latest sensation that allows you to use royalty free images, design online using a cloud software. And at the same time, it also allows you to create great animated videos. So without wasting time here, let's just jump straight to Canva. And uh, here we are going to learn how to create nice videos uh, that could leave a long lasting impact on your viewers. So before I begin, the website name is canva.com, C-A-N-V-A.com, as you can see from my screen. You need to log in and uh, you can create a login, you know, through your social media account. So I'm already logged in. I'll skip that part. And now straight to the point, I need to create a design. Once I click on this button, it gives me a few options. So you can create a PowerPoint presentation. You can create videos. You can design a logo. You can create an Instagram post. Uh, I'll leave all of the topics for you to explore in this video, since we are going to learn how to create animated video, I'm going to click on video section. So once I click on the video section, it opens a, uh, a new tab. And uh, give me a second. Let me see if it is full screen. It has to be full screen. So yeah, it makes sense. Now in this new tab, you see it. I see a blank canvas. I can change the color of my background by clicking on the background and then clicking on this background color icon on the top. Once I click on it, I can choose whatever color I want to create for my background. So I would, I would go with this green color. Now, I can create text by clicking on the left tab, fifth from the top, that says text. So I click on it, and there are some pre-set templates uh, uh, that uh, you can actually modify. So I would click on this one, for example, and there you go. The text is here. I can change the color of the text here. For example, free uh, text just sort of like uh, uh, mixes up with my background color. So I'm, I'm going to change it to yellow. And then the delivery, perhaps I'm going to change it to black, maybe, maybe green. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, I can choose whatever I want to. So I'll go with this green. So now the text part is taken care of. I need to put some elements here. The fourth tab on the top says element. Once I click on this element, for example, since we are talking about free delivery, let's just search if I can get anything related to degree and I get this nice icon. These icons are free to use. No uh, accreditation is required. No linking back is required. No citation is required. Uh, on the right hand side, I would probably also include something, um, you know, that would uh, that would assist this this image. So for now, I'm going to try delivery animation. Let's see if I can come across an animation here. So I'm going to choose this heart animation. <laughs> it's just a text, of course, uh, but I think. Uh, this would be a perfect fit here. So that's my first uh, template, first slide of my presentation. If you look at the bottom, it says add page. I can add more animation slides here. I can change the background again by clicking on the background, of course, clicking on that top background color icon. And I can choose whatever color I want to. But uh, for the sake of uh, continuity, I would probably keep the background color same as of first animation. Now again, I'm going to repeat the process. I'm going to uh, click on 
text icon on the left hand side and I will choose a preset text template there you see uh, again once again I can change the font color I can change uh, uh, the style as well by clicking on these font styles I can change them and by clicking on the font size I can change the font size by changing the color I can also change the color of uh, of this particular font so I, I'm gonna I'm gonna you know keep it as it is because all we are doing here is to teach you and now I'm going to click on elements and uh, this birdie looks looks good I'm gonna choose this birdie it's an animated bird not sure if it's a Twitter sign or something but it looks very promising by the way and then I'm gonna use uh, let's say these the stars here on the right hand side just to accompany the birds on the left hand side and that's it so far so good the overall size of this video as you can see is 12 seconds and I want to reduce it I can reduce the size of this video or increase the size of this video by clicking on individual slides and then by Clicking on this edit timing icon on the top, I can choose the timing here. So I'm going to, since this is for training purpose, I'm going to select something three, something uh, around three seconds per slide. So first slide is set, it's selected for three seconds. Then the second slide, again, I'm going to change time from three seconds to, from six seconds to three seconds. So overall, video length is now six seconds I can preview my video by clicking on this play button on the top let's see what do we have here there you go a nice little video now of course it's still very static and I need to apply some animation to the individual slide so what I'm going to do here is here's the most interesting part folks pay close attention to this click on your background you see animate on the top click on this on, a, on on this dialog box you see few icons with the crown uh, watermark these are paid icons I cannot use it only Canva Pro users can use it but since I'm using a free version I would probably use something from these preset templates and here you go it, animates all my slide now again I'm gonna select the second slide the same procedure is going to be applied here I have to click on my background click on animate icon on the top and then uh, from the free options I get on the top there you go I have applied it now when I play this video you will see a whole lot difference all of a sudden we have got a nice animated video but this is just the tip of the iceberg you can actually add as many slides as you want for your presentation by clicking on add page and there's no length you can create video as long as like one hour I can also add sound to this video so the sixth icon on the left hand side says audio now here you will see some free icons uh, free audios but my advice here is do your due diligence because Canva is giving you uh, you know a free sample for a uh, for for an audio but YouTube might just have you know throw you a copyright strike so the best option here is to go to YouTube and select the music download it and then use it so I have already done it so I click on upload section I click on audio section and here is a little sample I have downloaded from the approved audio library of YouTube everybody can see it those who have YouTube channel know what I'm talking about and even if you do not have uh, a YouTube channel you can actually create one and use all those royalty free audio clips so out uh, I downloaded one audio clip and then I uploaded using upload media there we go just uploaded it into my canvas there you see 
uh, it's, it says Zameen movement. I just kind of, you know, love this music. There you go. Nice touch to it. I can select a particular part of the music anywhere. For example, if I like something at around uh, maybe 51 seconds, all I need to do is just double click on it and it will auto zoom and select this as a starting point of my video. I can also increase or decrease the volume I want the audio. So I'll, I'll, I'll go for something uh, that stands in the middle. And this is it, folks. If I click on the preview button, this is our video with the music. Everything looks promising, very nice. And you can use these videos for your Fiverr uh, gig, for your uh, Facebook, for your Instagram stories, for your Instagram post for your Snapchats and for your YouTube intros and outros, sky is the limit. You can do whatever you want to do. So now the font colors can also be changed. Audio can be changed. Videos can be. By the way, there's another interesting part. If I want to make it more promising, let's just go back to the slide. So for example, I uh, let's see. Let's say I want my background to animate as well. Now, again, I click on the background. On the left hand side, I see videos. It is one, two, three, four, sixth icon on, on the left hand side, videos. Now, here I see few free videos. I click on this jingles part. Okay, fine enough. Thank you very much. Uh, this this nice stars animation. Don't worry. Even if it is too prominent, we've got a way to fix this. So I click on it. On the right hand side, it says transparency. It's an icon just on the right of uh, headphone, uh, speaker icon. So you have got position, you've got the speaker icon, and then you've got this transparency. Once I reduce the transparency, everything will begin to fall in place. And also, I'll be able to get this animation in the background. But here's an here's a, here's a interesting part. Since our video is of three seconds only, I need to trim this video to three seconds only to fit my slide. And there you go. That's it. So it fits in nicely with my, with my slide. So I need to apply another video, maybe the same one, maybe another video. So I will choose this nice little clip here. These are royalty free clips, uh, no copyright problem here and again I click on the video then I click on this transparency icon which is on the right of speaker icon and I reduce the transparency to this point and then also I trim the video through all the way to three seconds so it fits in with my slide size now I'm going to click on preview option and see what we have got here you see we got an animated video in the background. We got an animated video on the foreground. And we got an amazing video created here. You can use it wherever you want to use this. And uh, you can, uh, you know, create as many slides in this video, as many slides as you best possibly can. And uh, at the end of the day, uh, before I show you how to save this video, here's, let's just brainstorm where we can use these clips. So thinking out loud, I can use these free videos, animated videos on my Facebook, on my Instagram, on my website. If I'm a freelancer on my freelance marketplaces, uh, I can use this as an intro of my YouTube video, as an outro of my YouTube video. And uh, what else? I mean, um, they, they, they're, they're royalty free images. I mean, it's an open source software. And I'm using the free version and uh, the quality here is just unbelievable. Now, if I take you back to the uh, video part, I can download this video by clicking on download video icon on the top. It's very prominent. Once I do it, it sets up everything. And if I click on download button, it will prepare my video and download it inside my download folder absolutely free to use, no strings attached. 
this is it folks the reason why I came online was to show you how important Canva is for creating free royalty free uh, not only audio but also videos as well and uh, uh, you can use it, these videos wherever you wish to use them like this video so other people can benefit from this premium information and uh, they can use canva.com to create amazing animated videos thank you very much